Hello children, let us continue the class addition and subtraction up to 99. We are doing revision. Yesterday we have done addition using the number strip and I told you that today we will be doing addition using tens and ones. Alright children, so let us proceed to the steps. Okay. For doing addition using tens and ones, there are especially three steps. Okay, mainly three steps. What are those steps? Step number one is write the numbers in columns. Okay, suppose maybe two number is given like 21 plus 4. So you have to write that 21 and 4 in columns first. Okay, then the second step is add the ones place you will add the ones place okay then the third step is add the tens place then finally addition using tens and ones is completed all right so let us go to some examples okay so these are the steps you should remember first step is write the numbers in columns second is add ones place and this is add tens place all right children now this is an example see here it is written here addition using tens and units units and ones okay units and ones are the same okay even if it is written units or here it is written u okay or ones o you can also write it as o in your textbook it is written as o but this is just an example i have collected here it is written as units okay so here also it is as u Alright, so draw the lines to show tens and ones. That means first step is what? Make the column. So you are making the column. This is the column box. Okay, then here you have written tens. Tens and this is ones. Ones or units. Both are same. Okay, so now what you have to do here? Second is you have uh, the second step is add the ones place. This is the ones place or the units place. Both are correct. Okay, then the third step is to add the tens place okay so let us add and see so here 5 plus 1 5 plus 1 will be how much children it will be 6 right now 2 plus 1 2 plus 1 is how much 2 plus 1 is 3 that means 36 36 means how much how will you say like 3 tens 36 is having 3 tens and 6 ones or six units okay here two is having two tens and one is one units or one ones here it is 15 means one tens and five ones okay when you add you got here three tens and six ones all right children now one more example to show this is also same as i told you you may write if you write here o or you both are correct but our book textbook is following O. This is an example. I have taken it from outside. So here, that is why it is written here as U. Alright children. So let us add here 33. 33 means 3 tens and 3 ones. Okay. And here 14 means 1 tens and 4 ones. Alright. Now what you will do here? You will add it. Okay. So let us add it here. 4 plus 3. 4 plus 3 is how much? It is 7. Now here 3 plus 1. 3 plus 1 is how much? 4. Okay. So the answer is how much? The answer is 47. 47 means 4 tens and 7 ones. All right. Got, got it children okay now let me erase it now let us go to the uh, some more examples that I have collected from your textbook okay so here you are going to add see once this is from the textbook that is why it is written here as O okay and this is 10 O means once and T means tens all right so this is ones place you have to add here okay this is 
adding ones okay tens place you are not adding because in tens place below there is nothing see so you will just bring it down here also below in tens place there is nothing you will just bring it down just bring it down just bring it down here also bring it down and here bring it down okay so this means this this question is adding the ones place okay so what was our steps our steps was to write the numbers in columns so this is the column ones tens and then below once you are writing three and below tens you are writing another three okay then three then add it 33 means three tens and zero ones okay so let us add it here so it is how much three plus three is six and this three nothing is there in the bottom so three will come down so here you are adding only the ones place okay so this is adding of ones 7 plus 2 is how much it is 9 and 3 will come down all right children now the third question is 44 44 means 4 tens and 4 ones okay and here it is only 5 ones so 5 plus 4 is how much 5 plus 4 is 9 and let me rub it once 5 plus 4 is how much children 5 plus 4 is 9 and this 4 will come down ok now here 4 plus 3 4 plus 3 is how much again 7 and 8 will come down ok here you need to understand once more uh, once more I am saying here 8 means 8 tenths ok 83 means 8 tenths and 3 ones and this is only 4 ones ok here 74 means 7 tenths and 4 ones plus 3 ones ok so here it is 5 tenths and 0 ones plus 8 ones ok so how much you are getting the answer let us see 4 plus 3 is 7 again 7 came down that means 77 77 means 7 tenths and 7 ones okay now here it is 8 okay 8 8 plus 0 is 8 and the 5 will come down okay so here you need to understand that always you have to add from the right hand side that means you have to always add the ones place first then you will add the tens place okay don't do never do adding from the tens place okay always you have to add from the ones place then you have to go to the tens place all right now let us go to some more examples uh, that is also from your textbook okay but this one is adding of ones and tens that means both the places you have to add in ones place also there are numbers to add and in tens place also there are numbers to add okay so here also the steps are same first you have to write it in the columns okay so you have written it here then you have to add the ones place first you will add the ones place then you will add the tens place all right children so let us do it okay so here 54 means 5 tens and 4 ones okay plus 33 that means 3 tens and 3 ones so 4 plus 3 is 7 and 5 plus 3 is 8 87 87 means 8 tens and 8 ones okay now again here you have to again add 7 plus 2 is how much 9 here again 7 plus 2 same so you are adding First you have add the ones place then you add the tens place. Now first here also you add the ones place first. 5 plus 3 is 8 right. Now 2 plus 4 is 6 ok. 68 that means it is 68. 68 means 6 tens and 8 ones alright. Once more. Here 58, 58 means 5 tens and 8 ones plus 2 tens and 1 ones. 
add what you get the answer you have to write here this one is two tens and one ones plus five tens and three ones okay the last question is six tens and three ones is thirty sixty three plus two tens and five ones is twenty five so you have to add it here all right so let us start eight plus one is nine and five plus two is seven that is seventy nine 79 means 7 tens and 9 ones. Okay. 3 plus 1 will become 4 and 2 plus 5 will become 7. 74. 74 means 7 tens and 4 ones. Okay. Now the last question 5 plus 3 or 3 plus 5 same only. It is how much? Again. 8. Now 6 plus 2 is also 8. So what is the answer? 88. 88 means 8 tenths and 8 ones. Alright? 8 tenths and 8 ones. Okay children? I hope you understood how to do addition using tenths and ones. Okay? And in our next class, we will be learning uh, subtraction using tens and ones. Alright children, we are going to learn subtraction using tens and ones in our next class. So, only this much in today's class. Thank you so much. Have a nice day children.